Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. In this session, we will discuss the area and volume of a similar shape. For mathematically similar shape, the area scale factor is equal to length scale factor square and volume scale factor is equal to length scale factor cube. So, for area scale factor, if a length scale factor is given as 2, then the area scale factor will be the length scale factor square that is 4. Similarly, for other numbers, so 5 uh, length scale factor, uh, area scale factor will be 25. For 4, it is it will be 16 and for 6, 36. For 10, it will be 100. Similarly, for volume factor, the length scale factor cube for 10 uh, uh, length factor, uh, the volume scale factor will be 1000. Similarly, for 8 uh, length factor, the volume scale factor will be 8 power 3, that is 512. So, so in problem 3, question number 3, uh, we have the length scale factor for each of these. So, we have a, a area scale factor is 16. So, uh, area scale factor is equal to length square factor square. So, taking square root on both sides and this becomes 4. So, this a, a length scale factor will be 4 if area scale factor is 16. Similarly, for the volume scale factor, but taking the power 1 over 3, we can find the length scale factor from this. So, that is, uh, I think, 4. Uh, no, oh yes, it will be 6. Of taking the cube of this, it will be uh, 6. Similarly, for the area scale factor is 64. By taking the square root, we can obtain length scale factor, which will be uh, 8. For volume scale factor 1000, we take the cube of this, so it will be 10. The scale length factor will be 10. So this is all given in this uh, here. Uh, area scale factor 16, length scale factor square is equal to 16. So the length scale factor taking square root on both sides and this equals 4. The volume scale factor is 216, length scale factor is equal to volume scale factor 1 power 3. So that is 6. six. Area scale factor 64, length scale factor is equal to 8. Volume scale factor is 1000, length scale factor is equal to 10. Uh, let's solve uh, this uh, question number. Uh, Uh, 5. A glass holds 15 uh, centiliter. The height of this and larger similar glass are in the ratio of uh, 1 to 1.2. Calculate the capacity of the larger glass. So, uh, the ratio or scale factor is given as uh, the height of this and a larger similar glass are in the ratio of so the height one dimensional uh, factor or height factor is given as 1 to 1.2 so the the smaller has a shape uh, length 1 and the larger one has shape uh, length 1.2 so uh, we have to find the volume so we will take the scale factor as uh, 1.2 cube so calculate the capacity of the larger glass so if this is 15 then the capacity of the larger glass will be uh, 1.2 cube into 1.5. So 1.2 cube into 15. So it will give us uh, 2.592 or approximately 2.6 centiliter. So let's solve this. This is uh, we have this uh, V question number three, uh, five, uh, 1.5 uh, centiliter and this we have this height scale factor from this to this if this is 1 then this is 1.2 so the scale factor between these two height is 1 to 1.5 so this is v1 pi r1 r, r1 square h1 so v2 is equal to pi r2 square h2 uh, sorry so so, volume of the smaller glass is 1.5 cm, the volume of the bigger glass is uh, 1.2. So, this is 1.2 and this is 1.2. So, the 1.2 cube into 1.5 centiliter. So, this 1.2 cube is 1.728 and A multiplied by 1.5 Cl. So, this is 2.592 Cl. So, this is the answer. And uh, no question. Uh, let's solve uh, 
question number uh, seven to what scale is a model drawn if an area of five meter square in real life is represented by 20 centimeters on the model okay so this area is represented by this area right so uh, to what scale is the model drawn so let's solve it A area is given as in a real life is 5 meter cube and a model area is 20 centimeter cube. So, the scale factor of the real life area and the model area. So, scale factor uh, is the real life area and model area power half because this is a scale factor square. The area scale factors are in terms of squares. So, this is half. So, this is a 5 meter square is basically this 500 centimeter square and this is the model area is 50 centimeter square so this is uh, 20 centimeter so this will cancel and this is 2500 power half and it is gives 50 so this ratio between these two areas is 1 to 50 so let's solve this question number uh, eight. Uh, Three similar wooden box have a height in the ratio of 3, 4 and 5. Uh, wooden box have a have height in the ratio of 3, 4 and 5. What is the ratio of their volumes? So we have to find the ratio of their volumes. Well, the height as a ratio of 3, 4 and 5. So this is 3, this is 4 and this is 5. And the volume of the smaller box is 3 square. This is because this is a cube so this is 3 square this is 4 cube and this is 5 cube so this is for 3 cube is 27 this is 4 cube is 64 this is 5 cube is 125 so their the ratios are in the in this form 27 64 and 125 so the volume ratio will be uh, this this is very very important for p1 type exams so And the area of a rug is 2.4 uh, times as large as the area of a similar rugs. The area of a rug is 2.4 times as large as the area of a similar rug. The length of the smaller rug is 1.5 meter. Find the length of the larger rug. So the area is this area factor is 2.4. So let's solve this. A, a length of a smaller rug is 1.6 cm is given length of a larger rug has to find the area of a larger rug is uh, the area of larger rug to area of a smaller rug ratio is given as 2.4 so length of a larger uh, rug is equal to 2.4 power half and length of a smaller rug so length of a smaller rug is given as 1.6 meter so this is 2.4 power half one is 1.549 so multiply this and you will get this 2.48 meter if the length of a smaller rug is uh, 1.6 meter then the length of a larger rug will be 2.48 meter so uh, this is uh, the factors and uh, there are some other questions uh, so let's solve this uh, uh, last one uh, uh, two similar container holds one liter and two liter of milk similar container have a similar shape so their uh, radius and their heights or uh, whatever the shapes of this uh, container have similar shapes so the surface area of a larger container is 1100 cm calculate the surface area of the smaller one the containers have a similar shapes so uh, the 
container one has a contains one liter of milk container two contains two liter of milk the surface area of container two is given as 1100 centimeter square and surface area of a smaller container has to find the volume scale factor is two liter to one liter that is two so the length scale factor is two power one over three so the area scale factor is two power one over three over square so the surface area of the container is two power two upon three so the surface area of container one is equal to surface area of container two divided by two power two three so 1100 centimeter cube divided by two power uh, two over three so this gives 692.96 centimeter square so the surface area of a, a container uh, two is larger so the surface area of container one is, is smaller so this is uh, very very important because this surface area area so this area scale factors length factor and length factors square is gives area scale factor so this area scale factors we have obtained and from this two area scale factors the this scale factor is given so we have to find this uh, uh, surface area of container one so this value divided by this two power two under root three and this gives this value so this is very very important and uh, in the next session we will discuss uh, next chapters